Here is a jailbroken iPhone 3GS. This is only one week old on 4.3.5. And earlier on, my mother decided to turn it off, which is not a good idea. And I'm going to demonstrate to you what happens with a tethered jailbreak after installing lots of packages of Cydia. This is all you're going to see, people. This is the Infinite Apple logo crash. And this is worse than Reload Software 435 on a, even a BlackBerry. This is terrible. This means that your phone is now effectively as useful as a brick. Yeah, that I just all made up. It ain't. I'm going to tell you how to fix it. And it's pretty simple. <laughs> <laughs> okay, so. First of all, we're going to open Red Snow. Okay. You can download that off the link in the description. Uh, you're going to need your iPhone 4.3.4 4 firmware file. Even though it's 4.3.5, you need the old version to boot it. Okay, we're going to click next. It's going to patch the kernel, do all its magic stuff. Okay, we don't want this put into the computer yet. Okay, and for now, we just want to boot tethered right now. Okay, so we're going to tick that. Get all the result of the USB cable, put the torch on. Okay, plug it into back of your PC. This is a Mac, I'm running it on Windows, it's my dad's, but I always use it because <laughs> I can. Go away. <laughs> Annoying people. Okay, so we followed that. Okay, so I'm going to knock the phone down. Uh, follow this. Put it into the FU mode. So get your USB cable, plug it in. Okay. You want to hold it like you're going to reset it. Then wait till the screen goes off. Now keep hold the home button. You'll see Windows do some magic stuff. And that means you're being good for make. The iPhone will light up. We'll have your white screen, and we have magic carrying on computer. This is the pineapple. This is good. This means we're in a pwned bootloader stage, which means in English, it's going to try and get your phone working again, which 9 out of 10, it will do. We should hear the lovely sound of the trinkle in a minute from the iPhone. This has been dead since about 4 o'clock this afternoon. It takes a minute or two to load. Now, because it has had a, a unexpected reboot on being trying to start up, it is going to take a while to load, but it will eventually kick in. Red Snow is the software for this. We have life. There we go. Took its time because it's obviously fixing the bootloader. But in a minute, we should have a working iPhone. <laughs> so happy to see that again. I am really happy to see that. And we are back to life. Like, totally. Everything is absolutely fine. It's even remembered all the apps that they open. And we are 100% alive again. We've working shit here. And the speed is brilliant. Custom applications are working flawlessly. Bye, my mum sent a lot of text. All jokes. But yeah, this phone is fine.
not as good as my iPhone 4, but no, it's just got program 16, uh, 19 on it. Speaker's pretty good. It's obviously never been used. <laughs> but yeah, I'm so happy to see you back. That's how you won brick, an iPhone 3GS or 4 on the latest software. My heart was actually pounding then. I, I have been a bit worried about it because I'm thinking it's not going to start up, but then when I magically saw it come back, I was happy. So, yeah. Thanks for watching and goodbye.